Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I know I've been gone for a while, but it's because we just bought a house. So I'm going to be doing a little bit different today. I'm going to be doing a chit chat, get ready with me because I just want to kind of tell you what's happening in my life. So if you like this video and you like these kinds of videos, just give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and let's get on to the video. So first I'm going to mix two of my favorite foundations. It's the Maybelline Stay Better Better Skin and the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation, both in ivory. So my grandparents actually bought our old house. So that's pretty cool because we can still visit it whenever we want. And we moved in probably about a month ago and I did an empty house tour but we've been so busy that I haven't had time to actually edit and upload it. I've already primed my skin. Um, but I'll probably try to actually edit that. Maybe after I put this on. Me my youngest daughter are gonna go finish, well, we're going to try to finish Christmas shopping today. Except for my husband because he has a whole list that I need to order stuff. It's not just simple going to the store and getting stuff. But that's okay. He knows what he wants. Makes it easier on me to shop. I hope you guys all had a great Thanksgiving. I ended up missing half of it because my younger daughter needed to take a nap. So I just went downstairs and I just snuggled her. And I don't get to take naps or anything, so I just kind of relaxed with her and it was nice. Well, the big kids played upstairs with my parents and my sisters and my husband. So I'm just taking the Super Stay Better Skin Concealer in the color Ivory. I think this is the lightest they had. Whoops. If I keep looking over, it's because I'm watching my daughter. She's in the living room playing. And then I take the uh, Maybelline Fit Me concealer and I just kind of cover the little bit of redness that stay, stays on my cheeks. Just blend it together. So uh, the reason I haven't actually done the, I could do the empty house tour video, but we um, ripped the bathroom apart, the maid bathroom, because it was ugly and gross. So um, that is like three quarters of the way done, but it's still not done to where I can show it. So I could do either just an empty house tour or I could do wait and just do like kind of before and afters because we have done quite a bit. Uh, we haven't ripped the kitchen out yet. We're hoping we can do that in the springtime. If not, it'll probably be next spring of 2019. So next to set all the concealer and everything, I actually, um, Heard about this from another YouTuber. Her name is Kelly Jane. She's awesome. Um, but she uses the Wet n Wild um, Reserve Your Cabana bronzer as a setting powder for under your eyes because it brightens it. Oh gosh, if I had my brush, it's handy. So I'm just gonna take a fluffy brush and dust it under there. And then I like to take, um, oh, if I can find it, hold on. Okay. 
Then I like to take a little tiny stippling brush and just get under there. I'll use my airspun loose powder to set the rest of my face. All right, on to brows now. What are you doing? So I use the Brow Stylist Definer by L'Oreal. I think this is in, yeah, brunette. Does anyone else's kids love to play in your makeup? Like, I, every day I try to put my makeup on and she's like there, swarming like a bee. But she's cute, so I let her. So I'm gonna use my Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette and I'm going to use these two colors here. I'm gonna just mix them for my crease. I hope the lighting in here is okay. I'm just using natural light and I'm using the overhead light. So hopefully it'll look okay. I can't believe it's already almost December 1st and I'm already almost done with my Christmas shopping. And like I know what I'm getting my husband, so. It's easy. So I'm going to take my next color I'm going to deepen up the crease is this color here it's like a maroon color and I'm just gonna put that at the outer corner and drag it into my crease all right and on that first I'm not putting any more product but I'm just taking the first blending brush and just Blending the colors together. All right, and then same thing on the other eye. I can't decide if I just wanna leave this matte. So I'm kind of a little bit crazy and so I had a Lhasa with at my old house and when my grandparents moved in that dog is obsessed with my grandma and my grandmother just lost her two dogs and um, I was like well if you want you can try to just keep her here elements she knows and since she loves you, I'm like, if it doesn't work, then I'll just um, bring her here. Dog does not even care that I'm gone. People might think that that's mean to leave her, but it's not like I left her with a stranger. I need to drop her off at the shelter like I was going to take her, obviously, because she's my dog. I would never leave a dog behind. But... My grandmother and her get along so well. And she's the type of dog that will just sit in the corner and not be bothered. She just doesn't. But with my grandmother, she, like, sits on her lap. And she, like, sits with her and loves her. And I'm like, well, I guess she doesn't love me. So, I was thinking about getting my boxer another dog. But, I don't know. I don't know if I want to do the puppy stage. Because the puppy stage is, like, real like real real so then I'm going to use my elf liquid liner in black it's my favorite I literally I don't think I've bought a new liquid eyeliner in years well like I've bought a new oh. one of these <laughs> So 
So usually while I wait for my eyeliner to dry, I'll do my face. But again, I can't find my stuff. Okay. So I'm gonna take the Neutrogena Healthy Skin Blends in Sunkissed. I'm just gonna bronze my face. So I'm a dog groomer and you don't have to dress up to be like a, when you're a dog groomer. Um, but like I still try to like do my makeup really fast and I'm like trying to rush out the door, but I literally can't not bronze my face anymore because it I just don't like it and I'm as pale as can be so I always blend down my neck and I got this cute sweater from Target it's an oversized sweater I wore it for Thanksgiving so if I can learn how to insert a picture I can insert a picture of what it looks like I'll take my Tardius Pro Glow to Go little kit and I'll take the, it's called Chiseled, it's the um, contour shade. This is an e.l.f. highlighting brush. Okie doke. And then I'll take I got this little tart. It's called Party. It's a just a little blush. I got it as a sample. I like this color though because it's like a mauvey pink color. It was just sunny like five minutes ago. Now it looks like it's gonna rain. What do you guys think? Should I get a puppy or should I not? We want to rescue, um, but the only thing with that is I know Oscar, my boxer, really well, and it takes him a little bit to get used to a dog, another dog, and he's better with puppies, so I don't want a um, rescue group to come here and be like, oh, you can't have the puppy because your dog doesn't like it. I just don't want to get my kids hopes up if it's not going to work out. So I'm going to take my Smashbox Pearl Palette. This is from Casey Holmes. I love her. And usually I just kind of mix all of them. Blend it out a little bit. And then mascara, I'm going to use the Voluptuous Lash Paradise um, from L'Oreal. And um, I have to use waterproof because my lashes won't stay curled if I don't. Again, I hope this lighting is okay because it was as soon as I started filming and then it just turned dark. So I'm just going to highlight my brow bone. Oop. All right, so last thing I'm going to do is make Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink in the color Lover. I like this because it's like super pointed, so you can line it.
Hey you guys, I'm so sorry my camera stopped recording and I wasn't able to film an outro. But if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. I will see you all in my next video. Bye!